since I am sick in all my limbs. The sands of the holy place upon which I rest have covered me. You know, wake up. You know, clear, free me from the desert sand, and, I'm, and it implies that I'll make you the king of Egypt. And unfortunately, the text is eroded away just where he jumps up to say, yes, and let's do it. He evidently cleared the sphinx of sand and received the kingdom in fulfillment of the promise made. Subsequent generations had the incident recorded as the story of how he gained the throne by an oracle of God. James Henry Breasted, 1905. Tutmosis claimed the Sphinx had struck a bargain with him, and the great god that inhabited the statue had repaid him well. Interestingly, during the time of his dream, Tutmosis was not the crown prince, which leaves many experts to question this otherworldly forecast of his rise to Pharaoh. We found that there is something politics in this story, because he killed his elder brother, who supported